What is up, Scrolls? I'm Fizz here. Welcome back to another view. And today we are playing some Elder Scrolls Online beta. Uh, recently got the beta in a, in a message on Gmail. I looks badass. And I have no idea what to do. But I thought I would record it with you guys because it seems interesting and stuff. Uh, what does any of this stuff do? The dagger fall. I don't know this one because it's got a dragon, so I'm gonna think of that. I think. Wait, it says it's banana. Wait, does it say? Does it change? No, they're all the same. It seems like. Oh, here you go. Here's the here's the different stuff. Let's go Argonian. Oh my gosh, I played a little bit of Skyrim. It was pretty good, so oh, I'm expecting some good stuff from this. Um. This is the cat thing, isn't it? Yeah. Nord, human, and imperial. Uh, sword master. This guy looks pretty good. Don't know where to go for Britain high. I went for a high elf on. Skyrim. But I like this one better. So I think I'm gonna go with this. And then enter a name. Oops. There you go. Can't do can't do all caps. Okay. Let's do my whole name then. Actually no. Just done this. Uh Class Dragon Knight. Uh, ancient and martial art tradition of battle spirit and world full of magic that pounds sorcerer summon control wizard night blade I'm thinking I'm going as night blade he's gonna look pretty cool and I like mages but I was I like um like assassin is the best body okay so I like the height he was at like that uh, let's make him hmm, Like that. Body marking? I don't know what that does. Oh, wait, oh, I see. It's toes. Let's put none. It should make him a little bit darker, I think. There. I think his body's pretty good. I like it. Muscular. <laughs> I liked him around, like, here. There you go. Face. <laughs> it is weird. <laughs> like this one. Um, there any normal haircuts? Let's do it like this. Um, I think I like the one down here the best. This one. Then let's make it like dark brown. Or could do something like that, or a white. <laughs> now, so dark brown, age. Let's make him like I don't know how much that is. Dormant. Oof, no. Let's give him no beard, no head marking. And like his face, like this. Eye color, brown. Don't want to change much because it would make him look retarded. Which probably some people are going to go for. Let's leave him like this. 
I think he's done. This is our character. This is our MFS. Let's create. Logging in. Let's do this. If the servers are up. I think they are. The Walking Prison. Wayshires aren't just for resurrection. Oh no, shrines. Way shrines. Okay. When you discover a way shrine, you can use it to fast travel to other way shrines you visited. Okay, so it's like fast traveling. I'll try to move around a little bit. Ugh, I need to get closer. Okay, so WASD to move. Search the cell. Okay, I can't move. Why can't I move? Um. Oh, I have to bound keys, it looks like. <laughs> oh wait, no, it's here. Shift to run. Oh, here you go. Oh, that's pretty cool. How do I go? Oh, there you go. Oh, it's really nice. I like the graphics. It's like S S Skyrim. Come on. Talk to Prophet. Hi, Prophet. So, you know, you've been through an ordeal. Take a few moments to collect yourself. Like you, I am a prisoner in this place, yet so much more. I am the past and the future, both. I am despair and hope. The tapestry we weave is a complex one. You cannot hope to see its pattern in its entirety. Not yet. Okay. What do you want you from me? You must rescue me, and I, in turn, must rescue you. Escape from the cell, take up arms, and protect yourself. Then find Lyris Titanborn. Lyris Titanborn? Who is that? I don't understand. Leave the cell. That's a weird guy. Oh, hi, Mr. Lizard. We are escaping. Let me open your door. Okay, thank That's you. It. Quickly, you must escape before the guards return. Let's get the hell out of here. Run. Quickly, follow Odysseus. Take all the stuff. It says halt wait. Can I go to controls? Toggle run to auto run. Fine, there you go. No, I want it I want it shift. No, wait, no! Damn it. Roll dodge, I want it that. And I want auto run to be that. Okay. I'm so confused. How do I run? Hold not bound to run. That's good. That's useful. Let's load the faults. And now. Okay, how do we run then? Roll dodge, I want it to no, I want it to be that, okay. <laughs> it's, it's, oh, this is funny. Okay. So how do I run? Sprint, here you go. Shift. So it should be shift. That to crouch and hold that to sprint. There you go. Let's get out of here now. Uh, a lot of stuff is similar to things. It's got like the bar at top and the sprint bar. Pretty similar. It's really cool. I can't wait to do this game. I'm going to save up for it so I can do a series on it if I'm able. If it's not copyright. I hope it's not copyright. I read in the, the letter, it's like, free, feel free to make videos and crap and so it's like cool yeah, i'll make this stuff so don't be greedy we have a lot of prisoners to arm okay sorry <sighs> do i just take a sword i uh, okay Yes, 
badass. An enemy approaches. Strike it down. Take us on, you can't do crap. I did choose two handed warrior, right? Do not send a message. I if think I did. I was watching a video of someone playing the beginning bit and they got to choose their weapons like he chose a double hand like two two axes. Do I get that? Or do I like did I accidentally choose one handed? I hope you guys can hear me. Uh, it might be a little bit room for this video, but But we'll see for the next one. Are you all right? I'm level two. You're gigantic. How do I level up? No. Um. How do I level up? No, definitely not O. P. Not P. I put I press it. Oh, C. Okay. Let's do hell. Okay, there you go. Let's go. I wonder what's going on in the story. When it comes to like talking bits, when someone's talking, I'll just be quiet. What do I do here? Oh, that's where you talk to her. Crap. Maybe I should go back and talk to her then. <laughs> Lyris, where are you? Let's talk. You've got more meat on your bones than most of these poor bastards, and I see you've armed yourself. Good. I hope you've still got some fight left in you. You're going to need it. Who are you? A fellow prisoner. The name's Lyris. Lyris Titanborn? I was told to find you. What? Who told you to find me? A strange figure appeared in my cell. An old man in rags. The Prophet? He spoke to you? What did he say? He said our fates are into into yeah, inter intertwined. Ha. <laughs> that sounds like the prophet, all right. He's a prisoner here too. It was very dangerous for him to speak to you, even for a moment. You must think you can help me. I can still hear his voice in my head. What does he want me to help? You? Yeah, want to help you do? I Break can't him speak out, to of him. course. Believe me, I can use all the help I can get. That blind old man is the only person alive who can help us get back home. Tamriel's a long way from here. I'll help you. Let's do this. Ah, charge! I feel like just attacking some people. Tower of Eyes. Here we go. Loading might take a little bit. We made it. Oh, here you go. Oh my god, I'm inside someone. Who am I inside of? Who are you guys? Oh, I'm online now, it looks like. Come. The sentinels are at the top of those towers. We need to find a way up. What are these sentinels? Magical constructs created by Molag Bal to guide his vision in Cold Harbor. The sentinels are connected. If we destroy one, the others will be blinded. With any luck, that will buy us the time we need to free the Prophet. How can we destroy it? I have no idea. Brute force? We'll find a way. We have to. Be ready for anything. I doubt Molag Bal left the Sentinels unguarded. Let's go. Okay, so uh, we're going to destroy a Cold Harbor sent sent in I can't. I should probably just stop reading stuff out. You seem dead, my friend. Um, I'm just gonna back up from you. This woman's really tall. Uh, so there's one over there. So if we, it's that way, that way. But there's a wall there. So let me show this way, and then then go this way. Hi girl. Where is it? This direction? Yep. Let's go destroy a cold harbor sentinel. There's so many people up here. 
This game is really interesting so far. Oh my gosh. Oh, I thought he was trying to attack me. I scared me. Oh, it's one of those things from Lord of the Rings. Or whatever that thing was. Where's the Prophet's cell? Quickly, while he's blinded, we must get to the Prophet's cell. Okay, let's go. Let's jump. Jump! Oh my gosh, that was a bad deal. Okay, that just happened. I'm a ghost, it looks like. <laughs> that just happened. Let's help this guy. You're walking, my friend. Um, this way. Let's go save the prophet. This way, I think, yeah. What do we do? Always talk to Lalas. We'll never get in this way. Damn it! Destroying the Sentinel must have triggered these wards. We'll need to find another way in. Maybe Cadwell can help us. Who's Cadwell? Cadwell is the oldest of the Soul Shriven. After years of torment, Soul Shriven usually go insane and turn feral. But not Cadwell. He was already insane before he left Tamriel. Mad as a box of frogs, but completely harmless. You'll see. How can a mad man possibly help us? Cadwell sees things as he wishes them to be. To him, Cold Harbor is a wondrous place. It's his home. And he knows it like the back of his hand. He's usually down by the river. Let's go find him. Let's find this Cadwell. Mr. Cadwell, or do you need help? Well, seems like you don't. Well, damn it. I'm always jumping from places. It's like I'm invisible or something. One invisible? Invincible. Right. Two dead kings. Hello, what's this? Out for a stroll then? I'll be day for I've heard it. his voice from somewhere before. You must be Cadwell. Sir Cadwell, yes, indeed, a pleasure. And fair Lyris, good to see you, my dear. How are you then? We're trying to get inside the Prophet's enclosure. The door is sealed. Oh dear, oh dear. Well, that is inconvenient, isn't it? Tell you what, I happen to know another way in. Much more of a scenic route. Rather a fun little jaunt, actually, full of traps and corpses and nasty beasties filling up the bits in between. How'd we get through all of that? Rather cautiously, I expect. Watch your step, hold your nose, and do mind the traps. The like as not be a fair dose of running and skull bashing as well. Where's the entrance? Follow the river. You'll find the door to the undercroft at the water's end. Once you're inside, stick to the light and you'll find a ladder that will take you right up to the prophet straight away. Do give him my best. Thanks. Best of luck. Do check in now and again, won't you? Yes, I will. Bye. Okay. Let's enter a croft well, which is this way. I'm gonna help you, my man. I mean, I always jump into that. What was that I saw? Oh. I was trying to revive him, but he wouldn't let me. Okay, so this is the way to... to the Prophet. <laughs> I nearly forgot his name. The Wailing Prison. Let's go. And to the prophet's cell. There's a lot of dead people down here. Oh my god, are you off me? One gold, yeah. Goat meat? Yes. I love goat meat. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, get out of here. I'm surprised that didn't kill me. Too many traps in here. Is she still following me? Yeah, she is. What's this? Chunk. Let's go through all the stuff. We need this. Natural water? I've always wanted that. Goat meat looks like bacon. Oh, it's empty. Uh, I got distracted. Which way do we go? Oh, I'm going totally wrong way. Okay. 
this direction it seems like. Yep. This direction then. What do you want? Idiot. Okay, let's go to the Prophet. Die. They're like zombies. Which way is it? This way. Let's just jump off all this over the, all the spikes. Do I have to kill you? I'll take that as a no. Okay, let's climb to the prophet. Find the prophet. Okay, don't leave me. Just scratching my nose. Wow, this place is big. All right. The good news is we made it here in one piece, and the prophet looks unharmed. Now the bad news. It's going to be up to you to keep him safe and get him back to Tamriel. I'm not going with you. What do you mean? Where are you going? I probably should have mentioned this before, but it never seemed like the right time. There's a trick to opening the cell. The only way for a prisoner to leave is for another living soul to take their place. I need to swap places with the Prophet. Believe me, I wish there was, but I don't see anyone else here with a beating heart, do you? If Molag Bal isn't stopped, he'll destroy everyone and everything we've ever loved. The Prophet chose you for a reason. Get him to safety. I'll be fine. I'll keep him safe. There are magical locking devices on either side of the cage. You need to deactivate both of them so I can begin the transfer. Once it's done, get moving. The Prophet will know where to go, but he'll need your eyes and your protection. I understand. Good luck. Oh god, she's so bloody tall, man. I should have been taller. Lyris. The Lyris. I give myself that the prophet might be free! No, don't! The Lyris, I love you! The prophet looks badass. Lyris, no! Who are Take you? The divines, Why? You are safe. There is that at Important. Least. Lyra sacrificed everything that we might go free. Her sacrifice must not be in vain. Can we find a way to take her with us? I wish that were possible, but I promise you, once we escape Cold Harbor, we will find a way to rescue her together, Vestige. Vestige? That is the name I have given you. You are but a trace of your former self, a soulless one, an empty vessel that longs to be filled. It is as the scrolls foretold, but not exactly as I imagined. Why does Laris call you the prophet? That is what I've come to be called. My true name is lost even to me. Years of torment have taken their toll. Quickly now, we must make haste to the anchor. Anchor? The anchors are Daedric machines of the darkest magic. Their chains bind our world and pull it towards Cold Heart. I can use one of these anchors to return us to Tamriel, but you must lead me to it. Alright, stay close then. Okay, let's go. This direction it seems like. You coming? Coming over Giza? Oh, empty iron. Why are you always bloody urns empty? Okay, I'm not gonna look after this guy at all. He looks like he can defend himself. He's got bloody staff and everything. All I have is this one bloody sword. Well, I deserve two, obviously. I look like a trap for a second. I'm not sure. You okay, Mr. Prophet? Are you... Are you okay? You look like Gandalf. No, it's because you're really... Are you wearing shoes? It looks like you're just wearing straps on your feet. Get to Anchor Bay, okay. 
corn mash. I'm ready. Come on. Oh, he's healing me. Wait, where am I? Whoa, what's going on? Mr. Prophet? Mr. Prophet Mohammed? Mr. Mohammed? Mr. Prophet? Mr. Prophet? Mr. Prophet, help me! Actually, I haven't taken any damage yet. Well, I've taken a little bit, but not much. Oh, cause he's not after me. He's bloody after the Prophet. Pretty easy fight. Hint! Defeat the child of bones! <laughs> Die already! Why don't you die? I'm just like hitting your bone! Your legs! Bone legs. Your bony legs. Die already. There you go. Oh, level three. I thought I was a... Background... I thought I was like an assassin type guy. Oh, skills. I am. Oh, okay, I am then. That's cool. Okay, um, let's close this. So, Mr. Prophet. The Dark Anchor's portal is high above us. I will prepare a spell to lift us to it. But first, you must reattune yourself to Nern in order to regain your physical form. To do this, you will need a Sky Shard. A Sky Shard? A Shard of Ethereal Magicka that carries the essence of Nern. Some link them to Lorcan, the missing god of creation. If you collect and absorb its power, it should restore your corporeal form. I will summon one of these shards for you to absorb. I'm ready. Do it, Mr. Prophet. Shard of Aetherius, fall upon us now and anoint us with your blessing. There, quickly, collect the sky shard. Where is it? Ooh. What am I turning into now? I'm going to turn into Jaden! Yes! Ah! Great Akatosh, dragon god of time. Your children are lost in the fog between worlds. Uh, they cry out for what is mercy. Going on? This is scary. Hear my voice, Akatosh. I require your strength. Let the way be opened. Let the oh, crap. souls return home. Let the will of Moloch Baal be denied. Damn it. <laughs> I just, I just jump into that hole. God of time, your children are lost in the fog between worlds. They cry no, damn it! I did it again. Damn it! <laughs> Why do I keep doing it? Hear my voice, Akatosh. I require your strength. <sighs> I'm just there, with Mr. Prophet. Let the way be opened. Let these wandering souls return home. Let the will of Moloch Baal be denied. Great Akatosh, 
dragon god of time, your children are lost in the fog between worlds. They cry out for mercy. Hurry! We must go now! Oh my god, I just got so many like quests. <gasps> no! <laughs> the screaming man, the screaming is amazing. Wow, that was amazing. The screams, man, the screams. Okay, so loading screen. I only have a couple of these videos before it goes out of beta and we have to wait or get early access to once again. Why am I so small? 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 What the hell was that? Prophet, what happened to you? You're a ghost again. As I feared, we arrived in different locations. I am in a place with the smell of burning ash on a hot wind and the sounds of a distant battle. It matters not. You have awakened once again and we must set you on your path. How long was I unconscious? The voids between worlds was both chaotic and violent. It deposited us in Tamriel, but some distance apart, and quite unceremoniously upon our heads. I lost consciousness myself for a time. What should I do now? For the time being, your journey must continue without me. Venture outside, explore this new place, and learn what you can. Expose the agents of Moloch Bar, wherever you find. Why isn't the text saying the same thing he's saying? When will I see you again? Not yet. But we will meet again. There is still much we need to accomplish. Uh, okay. Complete Remember, rest. the agents of Moloch are everywhere. Where should I go? Okay, goodbye. Oh my god, what's going on? Oh, I love it not. Oh, that was pretty good. Well, that's the first quest. Hope you guys enjoyed that. I'll see you in the next episode. Goodbye.